Hi there, welcome to Storytime with Miss Becky. I'm Miss Becky and this is our friend Bear who loves to read along with us. Bear has a question for you. What do you think will happen if Clifford, the big red dog, learns some tricks from his dad? Like how to dig deep holes and how to look through trash cans for cool stuff. Let's put on the magic reading glasses and also see if Clifford can help his dad learn a new thing or two. Clifford's Day with Dad by Norman Bridwell. Whee! I'm Emily Elizabeth and I love to swing. My father often takes me to the park. My dog Clifford comes along too. Clifford has a father too, but his father lives far away in the country. Sometimes Clifford misses his dad. Last year on my father's birthday, Clifford did something surprising. He ran off in the middle of the party. Clifford just wanted to see his dad. He ran as fast as he could. That's pretty fast. When Clifford got to the country, his dad came out to greet him. He was so happy to see Clifford again. Clifford's father still thinks of him as that little puppy he loved so much. He wanted to be sure that Clifford knew all the things that every dog should know. Every dog should know how to fetch. Clifford's dad showed him what to do when a kid throws a stick. Then Clifford tried it. A neighbor's dog joined the game. The other dog got to the stick first. but Clifford brought it back. Clifford's dad is a good digger. He showed Clifford how to dig a hole. Clifford wanted to make his dad proud of him. Clifford dug a hole. Clifford's dad thought it was a terrific hole, but the neighbors didn't like it. Clifford had to fill the hole up again. Next, Clifford's father showed him how to look through trash cans to find interesting stuff. Clifford had a better way, but the neighbors didn't like that either. Clifford cleaned up the mess. Some kids were playing in a nearby field. Clifford's dad wanted to show Clifford how to catch a flying disc. The kids were throwing the flying disc too high. Clifford's dad couldn't catch it until Clifford helped him a little. Just then, a motorcycle went roaring by. Clifford's dad doesn't like noisy motorcycles. He started to chase it. Clifford knew that was a bad idea. Someone could get hurt. Clifford raced ahead of the motorcycle. Suddenly, the motorcycle was climbing a steep hill. Clifford's dad caught up, but the hill was too steep for him to climb. He stopped to rest. The big chase had a safe and happy ending. After all that running, 
Clifford's dad was tired, so Clifford gave him a ride home. It had been a very good visit. Clifford thought he had the world's best dad. Clifford's dad thought he had the world's best son. I think they were both right. Bear is wondering, would you like to have a ride home on Clifford's back? Yes. Is Clifford the world's best dog? <laughs> well, Bear and I hope you come back soon for more father-son adventures. Bye for now.